Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is a watering hole attack that's leveraging the EFF. You've probably heard of the EFF, or the Electronic Frontier Foundation. It's an organization that tries to fight for the digital rights of everybody online. In any case, there seems to be a new spear phishing campaign that's actually using them in the attack. Google recently found a new malicious domain called electronicfrontierfoundation.org. Do not go to that site. The real EFF site is actually just EFF.org. In any case, there seems to be some very targeted spear phishing emails that reference this domain. And if you actually go to this domain, it leverages a relatively new a Java vulnerability, one that was just a zero day a month ago, to install malicious code on your computer. In fact, it seems to be a cross-platform attack. There seems to be some script that can pick between a Windows or a Unix-based attack, so it might target Linux, Mac, and Windows computers. In fact, there's also some evidence that this is related to another attack campaign we've heard about in the past. Some people call it the Pondstorm campaign, others call it APT28, but in any case it seems to be a campaign that's launched by Russian threat actors and has targeted many governmental organizations in the past. It's kind of curious how they're using the Electronic Frontier Foundation as part of their lure. In any case, the good news is the spear phishing email is very, very targeted, and the site, though it's still up now is on a lot of the known malware domain lists, so a lot of people will block it. So the takeaways are simple. Do not go to the electronicfrontierfoundation.org site. Be very, very careful if you get any email referencing the EFF. And finally, use products that can prevent you from going to malicious domains, such as WatchGuard's web blocker. Anyways, that's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.